another five fish limit. They wound up with 23 pounds, our biggest fish just under five pounds at 4.81, Mr. Stafford, Mr. Holt. You right. <laughs> well, first of all, I've never caught 23 pounds of fish in one day in freshwater. So, um, awesome catch. I know it probably don't seem like that much after them guys, but um, it was still a great day on the water. Obviously, tell us what you what you had working for you out there today. We uh, targeted post spawn bass. <laughs> I'm thinking that might have been part of the problem. No, we uh, we fish deep all day long. We never did. We never fish out and uh, caught quite a few fish. Not we didn't catch no 30. I think 12 or something like that. Uh, one time we had to lay down in the bottom of the boat and bait the hook. They <laughs> hit the bottom. Of the boat. They settled down uh, and started catching. But we we know on this lake 23 pound wouldn't hold up. We figured it was going to take 26, 27, but it took 31. And two boats had it. That's awesome. Sure. Well, well, let me ask you this. Do you think some of the big ones are still deep? Or after you've seen that, would, um, do you think they've all moved I, out of the deep water? I think they lot more fish from uh, on the first break, 12 foot to shallow. And uh, they've already been a few fish caught off the bed here, not this week, but two weeks back, that little warm trend. But full moon's Friday, there'll be a pile of them shallow. That'd be an exciting day to be on the lake, wouldn't it? Yeah, we fish it next Saturday. <laughs> awesome. Well, congratulations, guys. Um, Y'all got third place, third in bonus bucks, almost six hundred dollars, five eighty-five. That ought to get you. Um, Just give me his. That ought to get you a sausage biscuit tomorrow before John. church. Good job, John. guys. Thanks. Next to the stage, another five fish limit. They had a total of 21.10. They had a 5.96 pounder. Mr. Bell and Mr. Tyree, come on up, guys. Chris is one of the few guys I know that fishes in a suit. Um, always looking good. Congratulations, guys. Yeah, I guess he's a, um, a bass banker, ain't he? Got to keep that, that thing on. Well, guys, a, another wonderful sack of fish. Obviously, um, for a day like today, it wasn't quite enough to, to do it. What was working for you out there today, and um, what would you might do different if um, you could have seen all this ahead of time? I, I mean, it was a mixed bag on baits. I mean, we, we catch some on crankbaits, some on lipless crankbaits. So, I mean, it was, I mean we, we caught fish all day, but we just never could get that real big bite we looked for. So. Uh, we had that one big fish, but you know the rest of them were pretty well cookie cutter, same size. So anyway, uh, as far as change, maybe uh, well we were fishing deep, so maybe pulled in a little shallower. I don't know. It sounds like everybody was catching them deep. So about the same from you. Yep. All right, guys. Well, um, still a nice, um, nice check to go home. Yeah, he's all dressed up. He's backing away. Uh, got you, got you a pretty good envelope to travel home with. A little over four hundred dollars. All right. So um, congratulations, good job, and um, we'll see you guys on you fall. All right, man, sounds good. Five fish limit. Our defending lake champions, a very, very tough team to beat with 20.62 pounds. They had a nice Seminole hog at 6.28. Steven, Steven, come on up, guys. Congratulations. You know you got a hook stuck in your shirt, right? Yes, sir. I'd be careful with that one now. Mm -hmm, sure. uh, Mike, where are you at? Don't do that. <laughs> Guys, what did y'all have last year when you won first place down here? What, you, what was your weight? 22 and a half. It's a lot different today, ain't it? Yes, sir. Yeah. Well, um, a great sack of fish. Tell us what um, what you guys did a little bit and what was working. Well, we started on the flint, some grass trying to trap, and bambers broke loose, and brother, there was boats everywhere, so we got out of there. Felt like the fish were disturbed. And went to fish pond, drained through a jerk bait a little bit, and got in the pond by area. Had four fish, probably what, 30 minutes, and yeah. had one about six and a half. And, uh, we left there, went to Spring Creek, and had a few fathers, but didn't do nothing. Get pulled out on the flint about 12.30, we caught two seven for them, two six pounders back to back on those. That was it for the day. Wow. Well, um, you had some good quality fish, man. Uh, um, I don't know if you're 
thought that you'd only make it to fifth place with that sack of fish today, but um, you guys are always a tough team to beat. Um, good job out there. What did um What did you see from your end of the boat, man? Um, I know you guys are um, enjoying fishing together. This is how many years y'all been a team now? We've been a team for about uh, ten years. Ten years. Yeah. So um, y'all learned each other pretty good. What was it looking like from your part of the boat? Early this morning, it was me and Nip. A lot. And then later this afternoon, I caught up with him. And, uh, you started breaking down, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you finally told him what you was fishing with up on the front of the boat? Oh, no, he knows. Uh, <laughs> well, guys, congratulations. Y'all still got a little over $300, 342 for your, your efforts and fine, fine results. Congratulations. Okay. And uh, we'll see y'all back on you fall in a few weeks, guys. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Another five fish limit to the wild. She's getting ahead of herself. <laughs> Looks like um, almost every one of our paying places is 20 pounds. This one's 20.07. Another nice Seminole hog at 6.76 pounds. Mr. Johnson and Mr. Smith. <laughs> well Randy, it was um it was a good day of fishing, man. Y'all um y'all got a nice fish. Did you have another big one? Didn't y'all have two pretty good size ones in there? I had another about four pounds. Another about four pounds. What did um what did y'all do that was working? <laughs> Throwing traps most of the day, all day long. Well um have you how many tournaments you fished in with somebody come in with thirty pounds? I don't think I am. Uh -oh, no. That would be, um, that's awesome. So um, you guys did a great job. Um, 20 pounds, awesome down here. You guys are obviously a good team together. And um, I'm just amazed at 20 pounds and you're only in sixth place, man. But good job. I would, um, I don't know what else to say. You said they want nothing to say when you come up. You kind of took the words out of my mouth. All right, guys, well, congratulations. Thanks, y'all be careful. I think this is our last pay in place for the day. Just under 20 pounds at 19.25, five fish limit. Mr. Davies and Mr. Cole. Be positive. Always. I am positively impressed with your bag of fish, man. Regardless of what them other guys did out there. That, that was awesome. Um, what was working for y'all today, man? We were like team number two, ripping traps in the grass all day, all day. No, we didn't. We didn't leave our spot 100, 200 yards of shore just all day ripping traps. When um, when you're ripping them, are are you pretty much definitely letting it get just all hung up in it and then snatching it loose, or are you sometimes, just sometimes, sometimes, sometimes it's right on the top, just ticking the grass and it get caught on the end. You just rip it. When uh, when you're doing that, you get most of your strikes right after it pops off that grass. Yes, sir. That's right. Yes, sir. How many total fish do you think y'all caught? Twelve. So y'all didn't have a whole bunch of them. No. So y'all catch them all day long. No, we had a we had a real slow period, eleven to about one one thirty, and then we caught about three or four more at the end of that cold three of ours. So yeah. Well, good job. What color trap was was? Did you have a? I mean, you got one. You don't want to tell me about. It. That's oh, okay. Uh, everybody knows it's sexy shad. That is a that is an awesome color. And um, Strike King's one of our major major sponsors. So. Um, I can't imagine how many lures they've sold with that color pattern on them. So it's um, it's a hot one. It's um, it looks a whole lot like one of them fishes that swims around out there that um gets eat a bunch. Well, congratulations, guys. Y'all still got a little over two hundred dollars. So that gets you a hot dog and a tank of gas to go home on. And um, no, hopefully, absolutely. They're going to the same place anyway. Congratulations, guys.